Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Rebecca, aka Vegan Bodega Cat. Today we're gonna do something that I've actually been wanting to do for a while, but I'm kind of glad I waited because now is more opportune. So Big by Melissa has several chains around New York City, and I don't know where else they, they are. Um, but they do like ship these mini little cupcakes. They're so adorable. And I used to frequent the store before I went vegan uh, because one little cupcake is a bite and you get to try like a lot of different flavors and a lot of different bites. And it's just a fun time. But unfortunately, ever since I went vegan around four years ago, I haven't been able to enjoy one of Baked by Melissa's cupcakes until several months ago when one location in New York City started serving vegan cupcakes as like a trial run. And I guess that trial run went well because a few days ago, Baked by Melissa announced that they were gonna have uh, vegan cupcakes officially in all the locations and I think you can even buy them online. So, what better time than now to bring my boyfriend because he has the sweet tooth in our relationship and go try Melissa's vegan cupcakes. In typical New York fashion, you can't really see the logo um, because it's under construction, but here's the nearest bake by Melissa. They have a sign out front advertising the vegan cupcakes. And the photo makes it looks like they have a lot of flavors. I guess we'll find out in a minute. Hi, um, how many vegan flavors do you have? Six. All right, can I have all six, please? That was pretty straightforward. I just went up, she said, hey, can I please have one of each of your vegan cupcakes? And then she just like handed me this tray. Like she had them ready, all sealed and everything. They had a big vegan on them. I just took it off so I could take pictures. But real quick, this is how they look like. Ta-da! According to this little handout I was given, we're looking at a superfood. I'll let you know which one that one is. Cookie dough, triple chocolate chip, chocolate vanilla chip, strawberry, and peanut butter. Now, the greatest thing about Melissa's cupcakes, in my opinion, is that you can get a whole bunch of flavors for a very little amount of calories. So three cupcakes is 140 calories. I'm gonna be splitting it with my boyfriend. So I'm gonna get to try six flavors of cupcakes for like less than the calories of half a cupcake. Um, that's a win-win in my opinion. Bringing in my sweets expert. Hi. Hi. <laughs> okay, so what would you like to try? So we have a triple chocolate chip, a chocolate vanilla chip, cookie dough, peanut butter, superfood, that one looks nasty. And then a strawberry. Which one do you want to try first? Let's try... What is that, strawberry? Yeah. Let's try a strawberry. Okay. Let's do a little up close shot. It looks like it's just strawberry on strawberry on strawberry. A strawberry cupcake with strawberry frosting and like a strawberry cookie dough lump. I don't know what that is on top. That does look interesting. Oh, it's really good. Yeah? I don't even like fruit flavored stuff like that, but... Mmm. Right? Uh, oh, I'm sorry. I don't want to get you demonetized. <laughs> That's good. It's okay. I curse my videos all the time, and I haven't gotten demonetized for that yet. It tastes like strawberry milk. But better, because I don't like strawberry yeah, milk. Yeah, I know you don't. It's more, it's more tangy than strawberry milk. No, no, no. This is what it tastes like. The cookies. You know the cookies <laughs> that are filled with, like, cream? Like the... Like the basic ass cookies, like like an Oreo, yeah. But like the knockoff versions or whatever, it tastes just like that, like a strawberry. Oh, one of that. I've never tried it. I just really like it. They did a really good job. I don't want to be too like generous, but I would give it a ten just because there's nothing wrong with it. Yeah, I give it a Same. ten. I'm very very satisfied with that. Um, watch me give them all tens. I'm just. Do you want to try the superfood one and get it over with? I don't know. I feel like you should save that for. No, no, yeah. No, I don't no, want to no, save, no, it for last, save it for last. What if it's bad? Yeah, if it's bad, then it's gonna. Yeah, knock it out. All right, here's the superfood one. If I would guess, I, I don't know what superfoods are in it, but if I would guess, it looks like sesame seeds, beets, and kale. Um, doesn't really elaborate on the thing. Maybe it's sesame seeds, beets, and matcha? Something like that? Why don't, why don't you give that the first go? This looks like the sushi, the Beyond Sushi with the little yeah, on top. Yeah, the beet <laughs> the on top. On top, yeah. Go. Okay. How does that taste like? It tastes like... You can taste the matcha in it. I don't think it's bad though. I like it. It just... Not bad. It definitely... You can taste the matcha easy. Why would you get a cupcake and have it taste like this? I like it. No. I don't like it as much as a strawberry one. Like if you were to go to a cupcake place, are you gonna get a cupcake that tastes like that over anything else? Literally any flavor would be better. If I'm craving matcha, yeah. It doesn't even taste like legit matcha. It tastes like... Nacha? Matcha with like medicine aftertaste. Yeah. Do you taste like chia seeds? That's the sesame seeds on top. Oh. No, that gets a don't eat out of 10. I give it a... 
I give it like a seven. Six. Seriously? Six and a half. Yeah, I don't think it was that bad. Uh. Okay, which one do you want to try next? I think we should knock out one of these chocolate ones. Chocolate vanilla? Yeah. We got a chocolate cupcake with some sprinkles, some vanilla frosting, and some chocolatey chips on top. Mm-hmm. Tastes classic. Nothing special. Eight out of ten. Mmm. No. I think I would give that like a nine. Really? The chocolate is really rich and then whatever, what was that, sprinkles on top? The texture of it, I like, like it's soft. Like you yeah. bite it and it's like, it's like a, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Did you, did you experience that? I guess. I'm not a huge <laughs> sprinkles person. It was good though. It was good. Peanut butter or cookie dough? Peanut butter. Here's the peanut butter one. It is a peanut butter cupcake with, I think maybe vanilla frosting and like peanut butter crumbles on top. Oh, there's peanut butter inside. It's filled. How the heck do you fill a cupcake that's this tiny? What does it taste like? It tastes like something. Yeah. It tastes like an, um, the candy bar with the really crispy peanut butter inside. Huh? The candy bar with the really hard peanut butter inside. No. The peanuts on the outside? No. It's really crispy peanut butter on the inside. Like like glass shards of peanut butter on the inside. <laughs> you don't know what? It's shards. really crunchy. And like it stabs you in the gums because it's so crunchy and sharp. What, what, you know the chocolate bar with what, the. What color is the packaging? Maybe orange. I'm googling this. A butterfinger. Oh, a butterfinger. Butterfinger. It tastes like a butterfinger. It took a long time to get to that conclusion. It's very good though. What do you rate it? I give that an eight. Yeah. Yeah. I give it a nine. Yeah. Yeah, I like it better than the chocolate vanilla one. Mm. Which one's next? Let's do ch chocolate. Chocolate, chocolate. Yeah. I'm excited for this one. Chocolate, chocolate. I wonder what these little balls are on top. I'm gonna eat one. I think those are filled with chocolate. That's what I thought so too. Mm-hmm. Chocolate. They're like tiny little M&Ms. Mm. This one's way better than the other one. That one gets a 10. Fuck yeah. Alright. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I almost elbowed the cupcakes out of Roberto's hand. And the little chocolate balls on top. Yes. Alright, sadly. Oh, thanks. Yeah. We've come to the end. Oh, no, well, you rate that one. Oh, you said 10. 10, right? yeah, that's a 10. I think I'll give that a 10, too. We've come to the end of the cupcake. Oh, this one's filled, too. Mm. This one's cookie dough, and it is also filled. Last bite of cupcake. Ooh. All right, I'm going to say something really disgusting right now. Don't. 10 out of 10. It is a 10 out of 10. No, no, no. I just no. spit out chocolate? No, no. It is a 10 out of 10. All right, so what was our favorites? Cookie dough, strawberry. double chocolate, and strawberry. Yeah. Oh, I didn't tell them how much I paid for this. So this tray of six cupcakes was, I think, 10.50 or 10.25, something uh, like that. Uh, yeah, 10 something. So it's basically like a, a dollar 25 a cupcake, a little bit less than that. It's not that bad. I mean, it is like basically a dollar a bite, but it's like a novelty item, you know, just like a quick, like cute little Thing you can gift someone or if you want to like try all the cupcakes in one set boom there you go the cupcakes do get cheaper like the bigger of a tray that you order if you want to try all the cupcakes I definitely recommend that because like it's just fun to go through and try all the flavors but if you wanted to save and get like the best of the best I would say definitely get the double chocolate the strawberry and the cookie dough yeah the cookie dough and if you just want to avoid the shitty one, don't get the superfood one. Unless you're like Roberto and you want to torture yourself with that. Oh, some people like it. <laughs> Alright, actually that was a lot of fun. Uh, thanks for joining us along in this video. Hopefully you get the chance to try the cupcakes for yourself since they are having them online now. Like if you like, subscribe if you want to subscribe. If you want to follow me on Instagram where I post every single day, I'll put my Instagram on my boyfriend right here. Also, he as well has an Instagram and a YouTube channel. I'll put down in the description box down below if you want to check him out. He's pretty awesome, but I might be slightly biased. Uh, that's all I have for today. I will talk to you next time. <laughs> As always, a huge shout out to my bodega babes, Jessica, Christina, Marlene, Lucia, Alex Creates, Laura, Ellen, Michelle, Kaylin, Marielle, Alex of Planet Earth, Emily Blaine, Juanita, Charlotte, Emily B, Jenny, Marcia, and Gemini. You guys are the absolute best and these videos are made possible with your support. Thank you. Right, I'm gonna say something really disgusting right now. Don't!